Good morning, scholars, and welcome back to Ms. Jackson's Learning Corner, where we talk math. Today, we're going to be counting coin combinations, okay? Let's get started. So as you know, we've been reviewing coins, and we talked about the penny. The penny is worth how much? One cent. The nickel is worth five cents. The dime is worth 10 cents, and the quarter is worth 25 cents. Today, we're going to be counting coins that are together. They're going to be mixed in types of coins. So last week, we counted just pennies. We counted just nickels. We counted just dimes and just quarters. Today, we're going to be mixing the coins in and counting that way. Let's jump in. So let's count. A fun tip for me and what makes it so easy to count coins is whenever I start with the largest value. Which coin has the largest value? The dime, the nickel, or the penny? The dime, the nickel, or the penny? Great, the dime has the largest value. It's worth 10 cents. The nickel is five cent and the penny is only one cent. So when I'm counting this, I'm going to start off with my dime and it's worth 10 cent. 10, 20. Is this a dime or a nickel? So it's five, right? So I go from 20 to 25, then 30. Now, am I going to keep counting my fives or am I going to go into ones? We were at 30. Good. 31, 32, 33. Awesome. Let's count this again. We started with the largest value, which was our dime. It was it's 10 cent. 10, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 33 cents, hmm. two dimes, two nickels, and three pennies make 33 cents. Let's keep counting. Remember, we want to start with, with coin that is the largest value. So which coin is the largest value here? We have a penny, we have pennies, we have the dimes, a one dime, and we have some nickels. Which one is the largest value? Good, the dime. The dime is worth 10 cents. Let's start counting. 10, oh, there's no more dimes. Let's go to the nickel. We have to count by what now? Fives, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. 33 cents? Whoa, the last one had less coins and it was 33 cents. Interesting. Let's count this again to double check. We start with our dime. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. It's 33 cents. Wow, that's cool. Let's try another one. Let's count. Let's count. Ooh, which one is the largest value now? We have a quarter, which is worth 25 cents, we have a nickel, which is worth five cents, and we have a penny, which is worth one cent. Good, the quarter is 25 cents. Now we are gonna count what next? The nickel, so we have 25, and then five more is 30, 31, 32, 33. 33 cents again with even less coins. So let's count that again and double check. 25, 30, 31, 32, 
33 cents. Awesome job. Let's do another one. Which one is the largest value? We have a dime and we have a nickel. Good. Which one is the largest value? The dime. Let's start here. 10, 20, 30, 40. Are we going to say 41? 50? 45. Good. 45, 50. Whoa, let's count that again. 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. We have 50 cents. That's cool. Let's do another one. Okay, so we have a quarter, we have a dime, and we have a nickel. Which one has the largest value? The dime? No. The nickel? No. The quarter. The quarter is worth 25 cents. Awesome. So we're going to go 25. Is it easier to count by tens by now, or should we go something else? Let's keep going. Let's see. 25 and 10 more. What's 10 more from 25? 35. 10 more. Ten more than 35 is 45. 45, and now we have five. 45, 50. This is 50? Let's count again. 25, 10 more than 25 is 35. 10 more than 35 is 45. Now we're going to add the five. 50. Cool. We got 50 cents again with even less coins. Now it's your turn. Number one, we have pennies and we see we have a nickel. Which one do we start with? Number two, looks like we have dimes and nickels. Which one would you start with? Number three, we have quarters and pennies. Which one would you start with? You do this at home. See you tomorrow.